Hey there everyone, <coughs> this is Mr. Krish and welcome to my channel Mr. Krish on the go. So today I am recording this video with the use of my uh, mobile phone. So the video quality might not be that crisp and clear but I am going to show you something that will help many of you guys many of you guys because today i'm going to talk about the throttle position sensor uh, 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 which used on only on fuel injected bikes and uh, this thing is a uh, cause to some of you i have heard some of you uh, talking about the starting issue of this yamaha fz version 2 uh, so I'm going to show you how throttle position uh, sensor works on this bike and also in others say this thing is same for all the full injected bikes so I'm going to show you what is happening actually you know that uh, how throttle works like if you roll it the bike gets acceleration so this throttle position indicator uh, this throttle is connected to the throttle body which is located uh, let me show you which is located here this thing when you roll the throttle this thing also rolls because this wire you can see this wire this this particular wire is connected to the uh, throttle and it rotates this part this is called throttle body this gives the acceleration to the bike okay so the throttle position sensor actually located in that portion so what happened let me focus okay so what happened i'm going to show you what this throttle position uh, indicator with this throttle position sensor does is when your bike is in throttle the when your bike is not in throttle the throttle is fully released uh, you can turn on the bike the uh, bike is in you can see the bike is in neutral position engine kill switch is engaged and if you don't hold the don't touch the throttle and just uh, push the push button bar push button to start the bike the bike is started as you can hear the noise okay so what throttle position indicator does is when you roll the throttle and try to start the bike it will not start like your throttle is engaged like you have rolled the throttle you can see these bars i am rolling the throttle at this time if you want to start your bike you can see bike is not starting if you roll it fully you can see the bike denies to start so when you release the throttle the throttle is when the throttle is fully free your bike will start very easily you can see the bike starts so i am talking about the problem uh, some people uh, facing the problem or the starting starting problem of this bike when in uh, carbureted bike mostly what you have to do you have to just twist twist the short throttle slow uh, slightly to start the bike that helps the bike to roll the ignition quickly but in case of this fuel injected bikes you do not need to roll the throttle just release the throttle and start the bike for some for some people who is uh, who's trying to uh, start the bike rolling the throttle, in, for, for them the bike will not start. This is the main problem for uh, this uh, thing actually. So this is a very important thing. This is a sensor called uh, throttle, what? throttle repositioning sensor which uh, connects to the ECU of the bike which prevents the bike to start when you are when you twisted the throttle the bike will not start this is the main thing so this is you can say a safety feature and any anything like that any any emergency situation when you throttle is uh, throttle is on a uh, uh, right a uh, twisted and you need to start the bike your bike will not start so this is basically it so Remember in a fuel injected bike no need to twist the throttle just push the push start button and your bike will start easily uh, in case you have a, a carbureted bike like I have my uh, Avenger 220 
so in for avenger 220 i need to twist the throttle a little to give it a beams give it a chunk give it a power to wake up but this, this doesn't need that just only put it if you ever twist the throttle and start try to start your bike it will not start so this is the thing i hope this is a small informative vlog for you guys hope you like this video if you liked it please uh, give this video a like and also comment your thought what you think about this video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel bye bye